Hello guys and welcome to another edition of All NBA 24-7. I am your host Rish Kapoor and, and on tonight's episode, episode 23, it's a very special episode because I bought something very special that I've got to show you guys. So check this out. I wish I had a drum roll, but uh, fortunately do not. I just bought a vintage Vince Carter jersey. The Toronto Raptors jersey, the first ever jersey that he wore uh, in his career in Toronto, in his first season in the NBA. As you can see, it's got the hardwood classic patch on it, the Mitchell and Ness authentic Vince Carter jersey. Um, you know, it's got his name on there, and obviously the first season he played with the Toronto Raptors, he wore this jersey. You know, it's got the Raptor on it, you know, the pinstripes and everything like that. And this is the back of it right here. Um... I had the choice of either getting the away jersey or the home jersey, but I felt like the purple one was better. You know, it stood out a lot more, so that's why I bought the I bought the away jersey. And guys, I've been wanting this jersey for such a long time. And um, I do have the other jersey uh, that he wore later on in his career in Toronto, but, but I, I really, really wanted this one. Every time I saw somebody with it, I'm like, oh my God. Like, I was just in awe. I'm like, wow, these guys have such, you know, an authentic classic jersey. And... Um, you know, I was able to find it at a sports store and, um, you know, and then, yeah, I bought it today. And uh, this is the jersey that, you know, I'm planning on wearing um, if I do go see him play live uh, in January. And, you know, he has said that, you know, 90% that he's going to retire after this season. So I really want to go to that game because this might be my last chance to see him play live. Um, I actually did go to a game uh, when um, he was on the Memphis Grizzlies. Uh, but unfortunately during that game, you know, he was injured and, uh, you know, I saw him on the, um, sidelines and everything like that. And, and, and I wore that Vince Carter jersey that I showed you guys earlier on in the earlier episodes. And, but a cool thing was that after the game, I, I tweeted him, I'm like, you know, I wore your jersey, you know, but I understand the injuries are a part of the game and, um, and everything like that. And, you know, I took a picture of, you know, me, um, in his jersey and, uh, he retweeted it. So, you know, that was very, very special. And I just gave him a tweet right now as well, you know, um, you know, uh, telling him that I bought, you know, his jersey and everything like that. So uh, that's special. So I'm going to be wearing this hat right here and that jersey, both purple. I just love purple, you know, like this is a new style Raptors shirt. And I don't mind this, but there's just something about the purple, you know, like I feel like the Raptors need to incorporate purple onto their core, onto their uniforms in some way. I mean, I remember during the 20th anniversary season, um, everybody was just going crazy over the purple fever. I mean, they need to know that. You know, bringing the purple back, that color, that dominant color is going to do wonders and is a great marketing campaign. You know, I mean, like I said before, that's like a, that's like the Boston Celtics taking away the color green or the Lakers taking away the color gold. You know, I, I just didn't understand the move because um, obviously this logo is nothing compared to the actual Raptor. You know, I mean, your team's called the Raptor, so you should, you know, have the logo of the Raptor on it. The Lakers and the Boston Celtics haven't, you know, changed their logos for a long time in the Chicago Bulls so I don't understand that but just very very happy that I got this jersey you know like I really wanted to show you guys it and um oh my god I just can't stop looking at it I'm gonna keep it in mint condition and now this is the fifth jersey now um you know added to my collection now and I want to buy more jerseys I'm planning on you know buying possibly um a Shaquille O'Neal Lakers jersey an Allen Iverson Philadelphia jersey Michael Jordan Chicago Bulls jersey I want even a Michael Jordan Washington Wizards jersey, I wouldn't mind having. Um, but, uh, yeah, you know, like this is just an authentic piece, uh, something that's never going to get old. And, um, you know, and, and it'll be crazy if I wear this jersey um, in Toronto because this is the first ever jersey he ever wore in his career. Um, you know, and, um, and like he played right in Toronto a lot of games wearing this jersey. Um, the Scotia Bank Arena now it's called. I mean, I'm going to always call it the ACC, but it opened, you know, because the game's in January 2019, so it basically opened 20 years ago. So it's like kind of like coming full circle, you know. Like, and I bet during the game, a lot of people are going to be playing, um, you know, the first ever game at the ACC and Vince scoring the first two points at ACC, you know. So it just comes full circle. Um, and, uh, you know, I just wish he retired as a Raptor. But I just, you know, I have a feeling that I know it's, I know that he said that he's going to, you know, 90% chance that he'll retire. But I just have a feeling that he might come back for another season. You know, like he'll be... If he does come back another season, he'll he would have played 22 seasons, something that's never been done before. So that's something that could push him to come back or 
come back another season and retire as a Raptor. I feel like he will retire as a Raptor, but he'll take the you know Paul Pierce route and just sign a one-day contract. But um, yeah, I, I, you know I'm just in awe of this jersey, and uh, you know it was only right that I got purple, so I, I felt like the away jersey looked a lot better than the than the uh, home jersey, and uh, you know I'm just in awe of this jersey, and you know just a great piece of work, and um, I'm gonna keep this for the rest of my life, man. I, I'm never gonna sell this jersey it's not about you know with me it's not about you know flipping them and making profit I, mean, I buy these jerseys because i just love them you know i've had my you know other two vince card jerseys for 14 years i've had my kobe Bryant jersey for 12 years i've had my team act jersey for 14 years so as you guys know i keep my jerseys i don't i don't i don't let go of them and uh you know and all of them are rare and you know i'm just very happy to add this uh you know to you know my uh collection so yeah, guys, thank you for, you know, tuning into this special episode. Let me know in the comment section below if you guys have Vince Carter jerseys or what kind of jerseys um, you guys have of your favorite players, like what years and stuff. I just love vintage throwbacks. You know, I used to love it back in the day in all the hip-hop videos. They used to wear throwbacks and stuff. I wanted it to come back, you know. Um, and it's starting it's starting to come back a little bit. So, um, yeah, just a great uh, jersey and stuff. And, yeah, guys, continue to comment, like, and subscribe to my videos. I got a lot more content coming through. And uh, yeah, guys, thank you for tuning in tonight and stay tuned.